Hey, how's it going, Yankees fans? Yet again, it is Felix from NYNews.com. Like always, hola como estas? So, a lot of people, actually, I knew it was going to happen. If you've been following this channel, I say things that other people are not going to say, okay? And I don't hold back. I told you guys what I really thought about Sonny Gray. I got bashed for that. And now I'm going to tell you what I really think about Gary Sanchez. Look, I don't like Gary Sanchez. I even designed him on NYNews.com. I think Gary is a phenomenal player. But let's be for real, folks. Stop living a pipe dream defensively. If you think Gary Sanchez is going to improve on his defense long term, okay, you are living in denial. You are living in denial. Stop living in denial. Look, let's be realistic. The DH slot on the New York Yankees is taken for years to come with John Carlo Stanton. I don't see that changing unless the Yankees, let's say, trade Stanton to the Los Angeles Dodgers. Really, folks, Gary Sanchez is not a long-term solution as catcher. And on record, I will debate anybody that wants to debate me live who claims that Gary Sanchez is a better overall catcher than JT Realmuto, okay? JT is one of the most superior catchers defensively in all of Major League Baseball. And to add to that, he is a great offensive player as well. Not as big as, let's say, Gary, but he's very similar to Gary when it comes to production, okay? And he can also hit. So with the situation that the Yankees have, Let's stop living in the denial, Yankees fans. The Yankees, when it comes to their designated hitter, that spot is occupied. You're going to tell me that Gary Sanchez can play and is going to improve as a catcher long term. That his defense is magically going to be great. Come on. Come on. To take a phrase from my friend, Samonetti Source, stop it. Stop it right now. If you think Gary Sanchez long-term is a better solution as catcher, as catcher, I'm talking about as an overall catcher, better than JT Real Malto, I want to debate you. Debate me. Gary Sanchez is a great, phenomenal offensive player. But in my opinion, he is not a long-term solution as catcher. No way. No way. And I could easily eat my words, but I stick to my guns, just like I have stuck to everything that I have uploaded on nynews.com. I don't care if it's popular. I don't care if I lose subscribers. I am going to tell people what I feel and I'm not going to sugarcoat anything. Sure, other people out there want to be fake. They want to tell you what you want to hear. No, I'm going to tell you what you don't want to hear. Okay. And time will pass and you will realize, wow, maybe, maybe this guy was right. Maybe we shouldn't jump the gun. Maybe we should cool down and listen to what another person has to say another person's opinion that is really in the minority okay so i'm not saying that i'm right i'm not saying that i believe i'm right i'm saying that hey there's another opinion another yankees fan telling you how he sees things and yeah maybe we should listen to other opinions rather than to say than to believe in all oh, gary sanchez is just magically going to improve defensively really if you guys honestly believe that if Gary Sanchez long-term is a great defensive catcher over JT Realmato, I want to debate you. I want to record it live. I want to upload it on this channel. I want to debate with anybody that's going to sit there and tell me that overall, Gary Sanchez is better than JT Realmato. Okay? I'm talking about overall package. I want to debate you. So if you want to debate me, leave your opinions in the comment section below. I mean, if JT is out there and if Gary Sanchez is out for two months, who knows how long he's going to be out there. If JT Riamato is on the trading block, mm, yeah, that's interesting. If I were the Yankees, I would look at that, okay? I'm sorry to hurt people's feelings, but like I said, I'm not going to hold back. I say things that are maybe unpopular. I really don't care. I am just laying things out there if Gary Sanchez is out for a long time. Riamato is a very good player offensively and one of the best catchers defensively in all of baseball. You look at that possibility. That's all I'm saying. All right? So people want to cry and whine and complain. The offer's on the table. Come debate me. Let's debate. Hey, 
at the end of the day, no hard feelings. We're all Yankees fans. Hey, oh my God, the Yankees fans have different opinions. Wow. Also, for the people that believe, oh, you, you hate Gary Sanchez. You want to trade him? No, I think Gary Sanchez is one of the premier youngsters in Major League Baseball offensive juggernauts, but he's not a long-term solution as catcher. Stop it. Again, I'm going to take a line from the Sam and source. Stop it right now. Long-term solution catching defensively, he's not going to improve. Okay, and if some people think he's going to improve, then that's their opinion. But evidence suggests that Gary Sanchez, he's not lazy. He's just not built that way. He is really a DH, period. And if we could keep Gary, in my opinion, the Yankees can keep him, they keep him, okay? But I'm just saying, you have one of the premier catchers in all the baseball available. That's just what I'm saying, okay? And Gary Sanchez, it looks like he's going to be out for two months. Who knows? I might be wrong. So if he's out for two months, JT Riamato is a good solution to, let's say, making – him your new franchise catcher that's just my opinion so like i said offers on the table if you guys want to debate me let's debate it we'll get on skype and you tell me how gary sanchez overall as a catcher as a catcher is better than jt real and i'll check you guys out next time